and y'all what's up so i want to talk to y'all about that female covert narc right why is she always pee watching and if you don't know what pee watching is it means pussy watching okay because this bitch is low-key lesbian or down low she goes both ways depending on what her target has to offer okay i find it funny that you know these bitches be watching and they will stalk you trying to figure out what you got going on and this and that and they just cannot figure it out but my question is why are you even trying to figure out live your life but see they can't do that because they're in constant competition okay they're misogynistic as fuck they're jealous of every other woman you know they're always trying to down play and put down other women they they are the ones that mean mug other women if i was a walkover or you know if i see somebody and I, oh that's a cute outfit oh i like your hair i like your nails whatever compliment and she bitch i don't owe you shit i could take that shit right the fuck back like don't nobody owe you nothing and you not all to that like you really not if anything shit some of these bitches i'd be feeling bad for because you out here looking raggedy and toe up from the floor up, and you can't get a man worth shit so it's just like really you need the compliment you need it while you over here trying to put your nose up in the air and all of this unnecessarily shoot I never get a break. Men are always trying to talk to me on a daily basis. So, you know, but it's funny though. These are the same bitches that like, they like ladies, they be, they be trying to be your friend. You gotta be careful, okay? They wanna be your friend because they wanna, they wanna be you secretly. They wanna figure out like why everybody loves you and likes you. Y'all y'all really don't think that my mama be on here looking at the number of subs I got, the number of likes. She's looking at the numbers. Baby, I'm doing God's work in opening people's eyes to these demonic ass hellhounds, okay? And you're a hellhound and you know, you better stay the fuck on, okay? The only way that my covert narc of a mom can remotely interact with me is to watch my fucking videos i don't fuck with that hoe she's nothing to be honored you know she thinks she thinks in her mind she's this big box this gift no when i opened the box there was a dog pile worth of shit in the box who wants a box of shit you know what i'm saying realistically who wants a box of shit how is a box of shit worth worth anything if i had some land right now then the box of shit probably be worth some i hope it would make good fertilizer for something but even then because these people are absolutely just you know satan's kids absolutely harmful it that i wouldn't even want to use that fertilizer on shit because it'd probably do nothing but destroy the land so but it's so funny like they really be watching like why you know just like uh i don't know it was some female it was a female hiding behind a man's name on here oh hey let me tell you about these covert narcissist females and I say females because she ain't a woman. She is an 8 to 12 year old child stuck in an adult body. So, you know, these kids, you know, um, they always be trying to just copy you. They, they don't have their own style. They don't got their own, you know, the type of music you listen to. Oh, yeah, I like that kind of music, too. You know what I'm saying? The things you like to do. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I, I like to do that, too. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. You going, yeah, 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 yo ass straight to hell. The fuck? 
Like, if somebody goes and jump off a cliff, this bitch would be dumb enough to do it too. Because she don't have a mind of her own. But, yeah, and these are the type of women that, hey, some of y'all men get entangled up with. You get entangled up with this female. She's very combative towards other females. And that's because deep down inside, she knows she ain't shit and that you deserve better and you can get and pull better. So what does she do to you, sir? Starts making you feel insecure. Starts, you know, trying to tear you down, taking jabs and, you know, hitting you, you know what I'm saying? Taking, you know, jabs at your self-confidence, your self-esteem, trying to lower your self-worth and value because she's worthless, useless, and beneath you. Remember that. So, you know, these, these bitches, they are the ones that, to me, out of all types of narcissists, the female is the most dangerous. Because for one, she is the one who raises the current men and women. And also is the reason why society is currently the way it is. You know, with her misogynistic ass. Oh, I don't like women. And this and that two-faced, breeding and brooding and just oozing envy, jealousy, hate. You know, teaching her son how to use women. Like, literally, that is what my mom has done to my brother. Well, use women. You don't got to get your own place. It's okay that you you a criminal. They're criminal-minded. They do criminal activities behind closed doors that they think no one else knows about. Oh, yeah, they do criminal activity. And if, uh, and if y'all seen that, uh, my community post with that old-ass text message on how she... They wouldn't dare throw me in the jail because I'm a concerned parent. See, with that type of thinking, that's exactly why when she gets slapped in the face with some shit, she'll never fucking see it coming because she think it can never happen to her that I would never slap a fucking restraining order on her. Oh yeah, I would. If I know that I'm gonna be married or I got a baby on the way, restraining order served. Cause you ain't about to pop up on me. You ain't about to pop up on hubby. You ain't about to do that. Cause I'm promised you gonna get dealt with. And you'll be FedEx to Satan real quick. I would say FedEx to God, but God be like, mm, your name's not on the list. You have to take the elevator downstairs. So, but for real though. She, 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 the female narcissist, she's down low. She likes to eat pussy on the low. And you know what? Ladies, they like to try you. They like to try you to see if you swing that way when you tell them no. Because they don't like the word no. No is rejection. It causes a narcissistic injury. It makes them just infuriate. And you know what? They get so fucking sick to their stomach that you could reject them. That they will be obsessed with you. Looking at all your social media, seeing what you're doing. Trying to, you know what I'm saying? Literally in stalker mode. You know? But let me tell you something. You can't worry about these damn narcissists. Hey, hey, y'all, uh, man or woman, you can't worry about them stalking you, follow, you know what I'm saying? Live your life. Because the biggest revenge that you can ever get on them is when you heal, you move on, and you live in a way better life than what you was living prior to meeting them. Because in their minds, they, they, they just it. They just the grand slam of everything. They forget that there was a time that you didn't know their asses. And you gotta remind them, there was a time I didn't fucking know you. And just in case you forgot, let me remind you, I'ma go back to living a good life after your ass. Boy, that infuriates them. 
and and then when you're doing and they could tell when you're healing they don't like that shit they don't like it at all all of a sudden they want to start trying to come back now for those of y'all who got left by the narcissist ain't it funny how they try to come back you know what i'm saying don't fall for that shit let that shit be dead dead that shit you know they ended it let it let it be how they made it now they done made their bed make their ass sleep in that bitch that bed got roaches fleas termites rats mice you know what i'm saying it's dirty because they got the fucking mattress and blanket out the fucking dumpster let them lay in that shit because after all they are pieces of shit so but yeah don't don't be tripping off of them and you know what y'all uh this is more so for the ladies with these damn covert female narcs they like to try to be all hey friend hey friend best friend they do weird shit you know they always want to try to like hug you and say lesbian related shit you know what i'm saying they be trying to test them waters trying to see would you go for them and then when you say no and, and i just want to say first off if a chick is a lesbian because i've had a lesbian like recently like bitch you ugly my coochie could never let you near her but if you was like riri pretty you know what i'm saying if you was like holly berry beyonce you know if you were gorgeous 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 there may be a maybe but bitch you look like a rat's tail you ain't got no titties you ain't got no ass you talking about you got the dick in the trunk bitch what bitch what did i just he did my did i just hear what the fuck say it for me a third time so i know that i heard what i heard crazy ass and then because i laugh at her now now her feelings is hurt well i'm not gonna talk to you well bitch it ain't my fault god made you a skinny ass hyena okay you can't pull no bitches and you can't pull no niggas like that ain't my problem that's a you problem all the way around you're physically ugly and you got a spiritually evil you know soul shit but for real they be trying to test you like and so i used to be like and then i know like years ago i used to be like what the fuck is with these so-called lesbians like why do you feel because you're lesbian that every woman is is also bisexual or lesbian no bitch no no all women are not by any means bi or lesbian don't nobody want to rub coochies with your ass i would rather drag my coochie on sandpaper put gasoline and light the bitch on fire before i dealt with a bitch out here okay the fuck i'm gonna deal with you for i got the same parts as you we both bleed every month bitch and you get an attitude with me i'm gonna beat your ass okay i don't got time so i don't know how lesbians be with another bitch shoot my mood swings and how i be feeling is enough for me but to be dealing with that nah if you ain't pop out my coochie and you're my daughter that's 2.0 that more than likely you probably act like me no bitch no but it just be funny to me like they really be out here you know and then and then like they can't just come out they be sitting up here looking for clues trying to figure out you know is she gay i think she's gay because of this i think she's gay because of that bitch stop looking for clues ain't nobody fucking gay over here bitch the only gay motherfucker is you you just because you like the carpet munch 
That's you, Captain Crunch. Shit. I was about to say some wild ass shit. I ain't gonna say that. I could say some wild ass shit. I'm thinking about it. I may or may not say it. Cause I be raw with the fucking shit that I say. Y'all know that by now. But no, like, like seriously, what the fuck do I look like eating another bitch pussy? Bitch, I am good throating a nigga. Sit point blank, period. Period. And then it's like, y'all hate men. For what reason? Oh, that's another thing about them covert down little bitches. Men, y'all marry these bitches. And she don't even want you. Don't even want you. She know you with a whole nother bitch. So I can only imagine how you feel. But they they out here, they just they just that bold. But anyways. Y'all stay safe from these covert narcissists because they do be on the down low. They do. You know, they don't want nobody to know that they on the down low, but they they be on the down low. And the men too. You know what I'm saying? The, these people will fake. They, they could be straight up heterosexual, right? But because a gay individual, gay man or lesbian woman, can provide them and meet and get their needs met and do everything for them that they refuse and cannot do for themselves they will pretend yeah I'm gay so now this gay individual is in a relationship with a heterosexual narcissist that don't even like they ass that's crazy right they out here just playing and pretending fucking and sucking on any and everything you know what i'm saying they wild the streets out here are wild that's why i told y'all hey close up the pussy shop men keep your dick in your pants but you gonna live your life and do what you want to do at the end of the day and fellas if i was y'all with this roll over wave being overturned and shit and all these different depending on the state that you live in you better fuck around and not get a bitch pregnant because nine months before that baby is born your ass gonna have to start paying child support and let me tell you about that female narcissist she gonna tear your dumb ass out the frame you can be dumb if you want to you can spread your seed amongst these bitches if you want to but ultimately who gonna pay the price you you better be careful you better be careful out here shit these streets getting more and more dangerous. I mean, don't get me wrong. I could care less about the Roe versus Ray, Ray Wade being turned overturned or whatever. You know what I'm saying? Because abortion is demonic any fucking way. You know, you shouldn't be killing babies. You know what I'm saying? You shouldn't. However, you know, I get that like if a woman was raped or something like that. You know what I'm saying? Like you shouldn't be forced to keep the baby but it ain't that baby's fault neither you know what i'm saying hell some of the greatest people on this earth were actually created from rape eartha kit being one of them and i absolutely love her fucking legend you know but you know she been through a lot you know but yeah y'all anyways stay safe be careful just mind, mind your pants. Mind your panties, mind your drawers. Okay? That's all I'm saying. Sis is just trying to give you some advice. That's it. You know? That's it. I'm just trying to let you know before you get caught up. And you can't say your sis didn't tell your ass. Because I'm telling you. These bitches be pussy watching. Trying to see how many. They, they be wanting to know who dick you on. Who you fucking and sucking. You know what I'm saying? And it's just like, why? Why do you feel the need to be all up in my business like that? But that's how they are. You know? My mom is like that. You know? But, yeah. I mean, you know what I'm saying? They, they like that. Anyways, y'all. Peace. Positive energy always creates elevation. Y'all stay safe out there. 
Cause you know these these people, they not gonna stop. I promise. It seems like it's like a hundred of them to just one of us. You know what I'm saying? Like I think last time I checked, I got like 550 subscribers at this point. The channel is still growing, so that's why I don't understand. Like I don't be checking for numbers. You know, I think I said it in, in videos before. I'm not hard up for subs. I'm not hard up for likes, shares, none of that. Because at the end of the day, if I was out here lying, y'all wouldn't be gravitating towards this channel. That's how I feel. You know what I'm saying? Everything that I be telling y'all is nothing but truth. So, anyways, y'all be safe out here. I'm going to always tell y'all be safe out here. You got to get to know people. Stop. You know, society has normalized, keyword, normalized. Society has normalized. We have magazines, TV, and music that sex, 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 sex. No. Sex is a narcissist weapon, and they use that shit against your ass. They rope your ass in by trying to get your ass in the bed quick and in a hurry. Chill. Take it slow. Get to know a motherfucker first. And if that motherfucker got a problem, cross him off the list. Dang it. All right, y'all. Bye.